No worries about stage fright for a group of improv comics in Seattle. They're behind a new political satire that runs through tonight. It is called Election Show 2004. We both know that buried 15 levels below the Pentagon is a machine that can control the weather. What? <laughs> now, Mr. Barkley doesn't want to tell you this because he's too busy manipulating the weather to make it rain on you. What? <laughs> Well, joining me now are the show's co-creators, Doug Willant and uh, John Boyle. Doug, John, thank you so much for coming in. Thanks, Thanks for having me. I've heard nothing but great reviews of this. Tell me, uh, tell me a little bit about it, either one of you. Oh, shit. Uh, okay, well, uh, what it is, it's a political show, but it is above the fray. It doesn't actually have any politics in it. We don't How is that possible? A, <laughs> we, uh, we remove uh, most of the issues that the boring candidates focus on, and we focus on the more important issues that the audience is wanting to hear about, such as uh, reviving extinct species for food. Yes. So we focus more on, uh, <laughs> the way we put it is we focus more on the handshakes and the winks of politics than the actual substance that they're trying to talk about. What yeah. gets you guys to put together a show like this? We were, uh, in February, we were working on a show called Twisted Flicks, which we perform with Jet City, and, uh, and we were talking about how much fun it would be to do improvised debates. We were talking about the election and improvised debates, and we thought, well, what if we just did a whole improvised election? And what would that entail? Well, it would entail attack ads, improvised debates, obviously, over-the-top punditry, scaring old people, things like that. <laughs> and we incorporated those into the shows, and it's all based on audience suggestions. So, Doug, what is, what is uh, somebody coming into the, the show tonight? What, what can they expect? Uh, they can expect us to come out and uh, get our fingers on the pulse of the nation by asking them what petty grievances they have in our, their lives, then uh, we're just going to go up and pretty much make a, a satire and a mockery of how over-the-top <laughs> elections can be as candidates run, how uh, no matter what side of an issue they are on, their attack ads can all seem very similar, how uh, they can just sometimes take things that, you know, 10 months ago nobody seemed to care about and they didn't talk about at all and make it seem like it's been the forefront of their campaign the entire time. I want to stress, this is improv. This yes, is not something, yes. I mean, you guys do it uh, a couple nights, but, but it's not something, every night you go in looking for fresh material. And Absolutely. It's every show is different because every night we get our platforms from the audience. So we don't know, like previous platforms is a new branch of the military comprised entirely of ninjas. One night it was mandatory <laughs> work naps. You name it, it's going to be different every night. You guys must thoroughly enjoy this to be able to do that. It yes. is one of the most fun shows I've it's, ever been it's, in. Ever. How has it been so far? I mean, through what, you, what you've done with this show, uh, I don't know how many other shows you've done, but how does it compare? Uh, this is heads and tails above anything I've done. It's just so much fun. Uh, I'd say it's the largest mix of having fun and being professional on, at the same time. And it is probably the best dressed show I've ever been in. <laughs> That's right. We all wear ties and, you know, we all... <laughs> Yes. Take that next step up. Well, if you want to catch the show, the election show 2004 is your last chance. Uh, it is tonight. It's playing at the historic University Theater in Seattle. It's 5510 University Way Northeast. Admission is, uh, what's that? $10, $10, $10, $8 for students uh, right there, and a dollar off if you show your voter registration card. Doug Willott and uh, John Boyle, the co-creators, thank you so much for coming in. Thanks, Thanks for having us. Appreciate it. Good luck tonight.